Welcome back to my channel. I do hope you guys are enjoying your summer. Um, well, what's left of it really. So this is going to be my Alex Adores for the month of August. I have so much to share with you, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. I'm gonna start with skincare stuff. I've really been loving the Aveeno Ultra Calming Makeup Removing Wipes. As you can see, I have emptied this bag. I've already ran through about three of these, and I really, really love them. I used to use the Neutrogena ones, but they used to leave my skin feeling kind of oily and greasy. I don't know why, but once I switched to these, I actually felt like my face felt really clean, way more cleaner. Uh, I feel like it removed a lot of the makeup, and it is ultra calming. It really is. My skin wasn't red at all once I was done taking off my makeup with these. So for lip care, I have been totally, totally loving the Lush popcorn lip scrub this is amazing and i love that you can actually eat it but i don't <laughs> they tell me you can because it's like on the back of it it says scrub and buff your lips to softness lick off the excess then apply your favorite lush lip balm so i don't do that but i love the taste of it it just is a little bit salty to me um it's not really popcornish but it's more on the salty kind of almost buttery side so i really love this it's not too fine i know this is gonna last me a really long time and it is very exfoliating it gets rid of all the dead skin cells that are on your lips and leaves you with nice smooth baby soft lips the next thing i have really been loving and i basically have been sleeping on it because i only had a sample is the benefit professional I do not use this all over my face as a primer. I don't do that. What I use this for is my pore area. So what I do is I would just squirt out a little bit of it onto uh, this finger right here, my ring finger, and I would tap it together like this. And then I press the product into my T-zone area, this area right here. I just press it in and like you can instantly see the pores being filled in because I do have a little bit of a pore problem, especially this summer they've gotten a little bigger. Uh, I don't know if it's because I've been sweating more, but once I press that professional in there, they disappear and this area becomes really smooth. I love this product, especially for that. Don't know if I'm going to use it all over my face yet because I do have a primer that I am loving. So I might do it and see if I like it. For my hair, I haven't been doing much to it. I've really been doing um, a lot of wash and oil and goes kind of. But what I have been really enjoying and I actually used all of it up is the Shea Moisture Yucca and Boabab Anti-Breakage Mask. This is really good. Um, I will say that I would prefer to use it after I shampoo and condition and then use this as a treatment instead of using it before I do all of that. I noticed that if I use it before I shampoo, my hair felt kind of dry. But once I use it after shampoo and condition all that uh, and let it sit on my head, then my hair did feel a little bit more moisturizing. I don't know what happened with that, but it does, does, does help with shedding and breakage. I noticed that um, once I was like, how do you say, clearing out my hair. I noticed that I got less hair while I was using this in my comb than before I was using it. So I think I'm going to add it to my regimen. Um, it does say that it's for fine thin air and it has biotin and bamboo extract in it. So that's really cool. I have used up all of it. So that's how I can tell you that I know that it, it actually does work. Um, but you're going to have to use it. I use it every week and that's how I've been using it. I'm going to continue using it because I really like it. For my body, I've been loving the Victoria's Secret Sparkling Citrus Dream Buffing Body Wash. This is amazing. It smells like citrus. It's more of on the... It is... There is grapefruit in here. It's grapefruit and red lily, but the grapefruit comes off a little bit more than the lily, um, which is great because I love grapefruit. I just love the citrusy scents for summer. It makes me, you know, feel more summerish if that makes sense but yeah this is a great body wash if you can pick it up at your local victoria's secret please do it is a great body wash and there is a accompanying spray that goes with it and i do have that as well and i love that combination together for blush i have been in love with the simmer mineralized blush from mac this was from the tropical taboo collection and i would encourage everybody to pick this up because it gives you the most natural glow to the skin wearing it right now it's just a beautiful blush if you're looking for something that's natural um that's, that's going to give you a little bit of color but also a nice glow to the skin i'd say pick up max simmer mineralized blush for the eyes i have been 
in love with the pressed pigments from MAC even though these are my two um, that I do own I love them both I've got beaming and I've got Damson Damson is a more new one this is from the new collection beaming is is um, a little bit older so these two right here love these on the eyelids uh, Damson gives me more of a purple kind of undertone when beaming is more on the golden shimmery side there are random dogs barking so this one right here is Damson as you can see more purple as you move it around and this is beaming just a nice shimmery gold color I have been in love with this elf mascara and shadow shield what I really use it for I use it today to really help guide me and it also helps with fallout especially when I'm using those Mac press pigments um, you can also use it this way to help you not get mascara on your eye makeup if, if you know you don't want to go ahead and use a q-tip afterwards wait the dries all that you can just put this handy dandy thing right here and put on your mascara and I use it to go under my eyes when I'm using my pressed pigments or if I'm using a deep color and I don't want to get any of it onto my skin so that's how I use this it's a really handy tool um, again it's from elf and it's their mascara and shadow shield I have been really loving the Urban Decay Glide On Pencil in Rockstar. This is more of a deep plum color. I love it with Damson from MAC that press pigment. The, those two together are amazing. And you guys already know that I love purples. So once I saw that I was like, yes! For foundation, I have not reviewed this yet because I've been using it all August. Um, I was looking for a foundation that could stand up to the heat in the Bahamas and also give me the coverage that I need and also you know staying power and so I went ahead and picked up the Makeup Forever face and body and you guys I am in love I haven't reviewed it yet because I've been trying different ways in application and fingers are the best but I won't get into review this is not a review just saying that I love this one um, I picked up number 46 instead of I think it was a color down can't remember but there's another color that's close to this one but it made me look a little bit more rich in terms of color so this one was a better bet it does match my neck which is good because I do have a tan as you guys can see <laughs> a little tan I got a tan going on so yeah I really love this it is a perfect match for me right now it's very lightweight um, if you need something with staying power and something that's going to hold up to sweat and humidity, this is going to do it. And lastly, the very, very, very last thing that I have been enjoying for the month of August is my contour brush from Real Techniques. I don't contour a lot because I actually love the shape of my face, but when I want to look like the rest of my family, then that's when I contour. Um, this brush right here is really good with getting into these spaces right here. I didn't use it on my nose, I use it under my jawline and I just love it that way. This is a really good brush. I love how it's curved at the top and it's just a nice slightly dense brush. It's dense but it's not too dense so you can really get a little bit more control when you're using this to contour. Alright you guys that is it for my Alex Adores for the month of August. Let me know what you have been loving and adoring this month and put it down in the comment section. If you've got anything that I have shared today please let me know if you love it or if you don't. All that awesome stuff and I will talk to you guys in another video really soon. Bye!